Five, four, three, two, one. Hi, I'm Shreya from Leadership Initiatives, and today I'm going to help diagnose and treat you. Um, may I please have the patient's name and uh, what they do in age? Thank you. How are you? I'm good. That is good. How old are you? I'm 16. Yes, um, by name I'm Dr. Sufyan, uh, one of the, one of the, uh, and, uh, and then my kind my patient is uh, Jabir Umar. All right, um, how old is he? He's 30 year old. Okay, uh, so may I please know what he does and like where he lives? Who does he live with? He's a, a civil servant working with the state government. Okay, so um, what brings him in today? Like, what's how is he feeling? What's wrong with him? Some... Uh, he, he presented with a complaint of generalized body weakness. Okay. Loss uh, of appetite, fever and dizziness. Okay, so is his fever um, on and off or is it just getting worse? They said it's on and off. On and off. Okay, so um, does he, so he has a loss of appetite? Yes, he has loss of appetite. Uh, does he present, uh, does he have diarrhea? No, there is not history of diarrhea. Okay, so I would like to take a, um, a uh, blood, does he have cough or sore throat? Yeah, that is good. So no cough, sore throat? No cough, no, no, no sore okay. throat. So I would like to take a blood, um, a rapid diagnostic test. Yes. What would you like to see in the rapid diagnostic test? I would like to see if it's um, malaria, and I would also like to see the severity of it, if it's uncomplicated or complicated. It's so like plus one, plus two. That is good. And uh, uh, he also presented with a temperature of 38 in the Celsius. Okay. Uh, and his fever is on and off? Yes, it's on and off. Okay. So um, may I have the results of the rapid diagnostic test? Yes, the result of rapid diagnosis test showed uh, he has one plus malaria. Okay, so for one plus malaria, um, I would recommend for his treatment, I would recommend a ACT uh, core attempt. And along with, good. yes, along with that, I would also suggest antiparotics, which is fever medicine to help his fever of 38 Celsius go down. Uh, that is good. That is good of you. And, and I think it's also better for you uh, to maybe do a, a complete blood count also. Yes. So is he having um, constipation? No, there is no constipation at all. So I would, yeah, so the full blood count test? Yes. Or, that is um, yeah. So for typhoid, uh, does he test positive for typhoid? No, it, it's negative. Typhoid is, is negative, but he has malaria. Uh, so it's just malaria? Yes, just malaria. Yes. So um, for prevention methods, I would recommend he sleep in like a mosquito uh, net to I prevent see. and wear full sleep clothes. Yeah, that is good. And what, what other preventive measures would you, would you like to give him? Uh, so preventive me methods, please wear like full clothes, like covered, covered clothing. Um, yeah, and then Bug spray, so bug spray and mosquito tent, so that mosquitoes don't get in while he sleeps. Yeah. So is there another other other method of prevention? Do you know? There is a new um, vaccine he can try if that's available near him. That's very good of you. Don't forget about vaccine. Yes. That is good. So any other method of prevention that you would like to? Of, uh, no, just mosquito nets, um, anti-pesticide like spray so that like the bugs don't get on him. It's like bug spray. Yeah. That's good. But I think it's better also to, to remember that most of the patients are in a very poor environment. So sanitary, good sanitary condition, I think is good also. Yeah. Yeah, that is good. That is good. So any other advice that you would like to give the patient? 
Uh, no, but I hope he feels better soon. Uh, that is good. That is good. You have tried. You have tried very much. And then I am very happy to, to, to get those feedbacks from you. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you. Thank you very much. Your patient is also visiting you. Yeah. Thank you. Uh.